Here in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can add live visitors counter in your Shopify store. So here on my screen, you can see that the number of visitors are showing on my product page. So this is how you can actually boost your sales because this is a kind of marketing strategy where you are actually visualizing your customers that these many people are already on our store and you can put any kind of uh, random number which you are interested to display. So I have already written a blog post here. You can see that I have uh, written the steps. So you should go to the dashboard of the store and here we have the dashboard. I have installed down theme. If you have any other theme, then still this feature will work. So click on these three dots, click on duplicate. So later on, if you want, you can actually roll it back to its original version. Then after you should click on edit code and here we have some folders and files. So you should go to snippets and then move ahead with the second step. Create new snippet and name it live visitors. So I'm going to create a new snippet here. You should go to snippets and click on add a new snippet and you should paste the name here live dash visitors and click on done. And then after you should copy this complete code, which is this one and paste it inside of this file and then click on save once the changes are saved. So let me show you the preview first. So here is the preview. I have some products. You should go to the catalogs. We have, for example, this product. And I'm interested to display this uh, below this price or maybe above this price. So how we can display it? You should go to man product. So for example, I have man dash product. So this is the liquid file and inside of it, I have to find price. So you can see that there are many sections here. So for example, this is the price and uh, just below this price, I'm interested to display that uh, value. So for example, this is the inventory and just above it, I'm going to render that snippet. So how you should do that, you should use this syntax and right here, render and uh, live dash visitors. Okay. And then you should click on save. So you should refresh. So here we go. Now you can see that number of visitors are displaying here. 504 people are viewing right now. After seven seconds, it will be uh, changed because I have already set the value of uh, seven seconds here. So let me show you how you can customize the things. So here you can see that we have maximum number of visits, uh, visitors. I have maximum uh, value 600. Uh, and minimum value is 500. So in between 600 and 500, the values will be updated here. Okay. And after seven seconds, I have added seven seconds. So you can reduce or maybe increase number of seconds according to your requirement. So for example, you are putting 4,000, then you should save the changes and this will actually update after four seconds. So here we go. After four seconds, it will be updated. So you can see that we have 600, after four seconds, one, two, three, four. Here is the new updated value, one, two, three, four. And here is the new value. So accordingly, this new value will be updated. And one more thing is that you can also update this uh, title. Uh, people are viewing right now. So here is the title here. Uh, people are viewing right now. You can update this text with any of your text which you are interested to put. If you want any kind of improvement in this, so you can do it. And if you have any problem or something, you can definitely ask me. I will help you out in that. If you have any new sections to create or new feature to develop, so you can uh, ask me in the comment section or maybe I have already added contact details below in the description. So you can directly message me and I will immediately help you out in that. Okay. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you are new on this channel, then please subscribe this channel. Also like this video. Thank you once again. See you in the next video.